Hello and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Origins. In this episode, we're going to be looking at the Reggie Trio, as in Reggie Rock, Reggie Ice, and Reggie Steel. So, first to get Reggie Rock here, its Japanese name is the same as its English name, and it is the Rock Peak Pokemon. It's number 377 in the National Dex, stands at 1.7 meters tall or 5 foot 7 inches, and weighs 230 kilograms or 507.1 pounds. Reggie Rock is a rock type and a member of the Reggie Trio. Reggie Rock is a large golem made of rocks and it has a pattern on its face that resembles a H. If it gets damaged in battle, it searches rocks to repair itself, hence why it looks very patchworky and not, you know, clean. Reggie Rock has no internal organs, so no brain, no heart, no liver, anything, so it's more like rocks but have got a strange power. It's based off of the golems of Hebrew legend and they were servants of higher power with writing on their heads, hence the H on its head. It is also a reference to the Stone Age as it relates to the other Regis as we'll look at in a minute. Regirock is a genderless Pokemon so therefore there are no gender differences and its shiny form is a, uh, all the rocks are kind of dark brown orange colour. Pokedex entries tells us that Regirock's body is made completely of rock and that if it is damaged it repairs itself by finding rocks around the place. The name Reggie Rock comes from Regis, which is Latin for royal, and rock, so royal rock really. Regice now, it's the iceberg Pokemon and is number 378 in the natural decks and stands at 1.8 meters tall or 5 foot 11 inches and weighs 175 kilograms or 385.8 pounds. Regis is an ice type and also a member of the Reggie Trio. Regis' body is composed of ice that resembles a crystal and it has a face pattern of dots in a plus formation on its head. It has four spike-like objects on its back and its legs are cones and it seems to balance itself on these two points. Like Reggie Rock, it was based on the Garms of Hebrew legend and is also a reference to the Ice Age. Like Reggie Rock, it is a genderless Pokemon so therefore there are no gender differences and its shiny form is kind of a lighter blue crystal colour instead of the current colour. Pokedex entries tell us that Reggie's is made of ice from the Ice Age and that its body cannot be melted by anything, even magma. The name Regis comes from Regis, the Latin for royal, and ice, so royal ice. Finally looking at Regis still here, it is the iron Pokemon, and it's number 379 in the National Dex, and stands at 1.9 meters tall or 6 foot 3 inches, and weighs 205 kilograms or 451.9 pounds. Regis still is a steel type and a member of the Regi Trio. Reggie still has a spherical grey head with a black stripe running down its kind of its, its face, and it has seven dots in a hexagonal formation on its face. It also has black arms that have three fingers each and cylindrical legs, and like the other two, it's based on the Hebrew golems, and it's also a reference to the Iron Age. So we have the Stone Age, the Ice Age, and the Iron Age. Reggie still has gender Pokémon, so there are no gender differences, and its shiny Pokémon is a green metallic colour. Pokedex entries tell us that Registeel's body cannot be scratched and that its body is harder than any kind of metal known. Registeel is a combination of Regis, Latin for royal, and steel, so royal steel. Now if we look at some height comparisons here, you can see Registeel is the tallest of the three at 1.9 meters, Regis is the middle at 1.8, and then Regirock is the smallest at 1.7. So they're all pretty big, about the same size as me, maybe a bit bigger, maybe a bit smaller, depending on how you're looking at it. But yeah, that's the size comparison there. And finally onto the sprite comparisons here, again first looking at Reggie Rock, not much to see here because there's only 3 generations, but um, in generation 3 it's just stood there, in generation 4 it's kind of got its arms ready to fight, and generation 5 it's stood there again. Ge uh, Reggie's now on generation 3 it's stood there, generation 4 it's kind of flying, um, and then generation 5 it's stood there again. Reggie still finally, generation 3 it's stood there. And Generation 4, in Diamond you have that very controversial um, sprite there that was actually removed from the English game in Europe. I'm not sure about the US though, but it was in the Japan version. And um, Platinum, it's been removed obviously. And then in Black, in Generation 5, sorry, it's standing just like in Platinum. And so in this episode of Pokemon Origins. Don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.